Mild order move looks like it is set to start the week with a bit of a bounce, but will this rally be short-lived? Hi again everyone, I hope you're all doing really well. So over the weekend I sort of speculated that there is the possibility that Marlin Auto Mode could be in for a bit of a correction or a bit of a bounce come uh, Monday. Not on the back of a short squeeze or anything, but I think mainly on the fact that um, you know, there's been quite a big sell-off and the actual number of shorts that have been driving down the stock has actually significantly reduced. So at the present, we're about three hours from market open and the stock's up by about 4% or two and a half cents, which I know in the scheme of things isn't much. It only takes us to 66 and a half cents. So we're still far from that $1 market. We need to be getting the price up to around, um, you know, in terms of trying to regain that NASDAQ compliance. But, you know, it, and, it is the, and it is the pre-market, so it's not necessarily a you know, a sign of what's exactly going to come out in the day, but there is some early positive sentiment for where Marlin Automotive is priced at at the moment. Um, so I think, you know, that may cover it, carry into the regular, regular day trade. And the fact that at the moment, there's not that much shorting action happening in the stock, it's been heavily reduced. We might actually get a bit of a natural correction. Now, what we'd be hoping for is that at these low prices, if they start utilizing more of that um, $25 million for buying back stocks, this would actually be quite good because it's obviously, with the stock price being beaten down more, it's going to actually take an even higher number of shares off the market and tighten up the holding and reduce the liquidity by even more, which is actually only going to do good things um, for the share price in theory. Of course, theory doesn't necessarily always apply to stocks like Mullen or Remote. It's highly speculative. That's why everything I say on here is never financial advice. Um, but yeah, just looks like we're heading towards something a little bit positive to start the week. Uh, yeah, anyway, uh, just a really brief video. Um, anyway, I'd love to hear what you guys are thinking about Mullen Are we Are we actually indeed going to see a bit of a um, correction on Monday? Um, and if so, do you think it's going to be a short-lived one? My gut feeling is that you know, if we don't get some strong price action today, uh, the stock could be in really big trouble because it leaves only 11 days to get back to above the $1 mark. And we need to do it for 10 consecutive days uh, before September 6th. So I think, you know, we do need to see some movement up today. We need positive momentum today and we need that to kind of continue, obviously, for the next few days. We need to get the price back above a dollar. Um, yeah, it's really up against it. Anyway, share your thoughts on where you think Mullen's going to end up this week. Do you think we're going to get above the dollar mark or do you think we're going to just continue to languish and perhaps even sell off anymore? Uh, love to hear what you all think. Um, also, if you come across any sort of news about what's going on with Mullen or Move, uh, drop it in the comments below. I uh, always love to hear what you guys are thinking. Till next time, everyone. May the markets trade in your favour. Cheers.